Hey! What's up, gamers? Welcome back to the channel. If you're a newcomer diving into Soul Knight prequel, you're in for a treat. Today, I've gathered some pro tips to help you level up your game. So, without wasting any time, let's jump right into it. Tip 1. Skill Points Reset. Mess up your skills? No problem. Visit the NPC Reset Merchant to rebuild your skill tree. Don't let a few misplaced points ruin your game. Tip 2. Optimize your skill rotation bar. Alright, first things first. Every class in Soul Knight prequel has skills that toggle on, off status, and you can spot them by this mana lock line. Now, the real trick is to utilize these skills in your secondary skill set. Even when you switch weapons, their effectiveness is maintained and stacks with other skills. Quick combat tip. Press and tap a skill twice for automatic target selection. No need to angle it, just fire away. Tip 3. Keep your inventory clean. Ever see that line about cleaning your bag before entering the map? Take it seriously. Clear items outside. Use the Rarity Filter button, and remember to lock important items. In the third stage, NPCs, card collections, and furnaces await. Toss the unnecessary items there. Don't forget items left behind. The engineer NPC in the village will collect them, but it'll cost you gold. Tip 4. Unlock Hidden Equipment Destiny. Here's a cool one. All shoes and hats have a hidden destiny, but it activates only when you have two-thirds items of the same type. For example, stack three int stat items to create a level 3 vestment mage with 100% mana recovery. Experiment with different combinations to find what suits your class and playstyle. Tip 5. Transfer equipment between characters. Need to share some gear between characters? Simple. Send the item to storage and retrieve it on another character. No need to grind separately. Tip 6. Quick character switch and travel. Quickly switch characters by entering your house and selecting the one you want. While in the village, click on the map to choose your destination. Your character will teleport, saving valuable travel time. Oh, and here's a bonus. Slap the village gate a few times for extra coins, it's a secret. Tip 7. Pet your pet daily. Don't forget to show some love to your pet every day. Use your bare hands to increase intimacy. Happy pet, happy life. Tip 8. Merchant NPCs stat reset. Lastly, did you know merchant NPCs can reset stat points too? Hold the button to speed up the process. And there you have it, folks, a bunch of tips to get you started on your Soul Knight prequel journey. If you found these helpful, drop a like, subscribe for more gaming content, and I'll catch you in the next one. Game on!